We're out here in Key West. Going down the river here. We we'll went to get some lunch. We're floating back. and going take a look at some different little areas here. Hey, so I want to give you some tips for having a fun time kayaking out in Key West. Um, first tip is going, to be, is going to be bring suntan lotion. It's extremely hot. Um, there's no real shade out there, obviously. So you want to make sure that you have suntan lotion. Um, the pricing on average is going to be around 20 bucks, maybe a little bit less, a little bit more. Um, but you can kind of find a lot of different places that are going to rent you kayak for the day. You're going to want to bring your own water, uh, some ice as well if you can. A lot of times they don't have anything where they rent the kayaks. Um, destination, I recommend grabbing some, some lunch. So if you can kind of plot it out on your phone, use Google Maps, see if there's somewhere you can kayak to lunch, that's awesome. Little stop, get you out of the sun for a while, get you in the shade, um, and it's a great destination to go to. Um, but if not, then just plan maybe a beach or something like that. Just have somewhere you want to go kind of on the map, kind of pre-planned. If your wa phone's not waterproof, you might need to leave it in your car in case you, you know, so you don't get it wet. Jumping in the water is always a fun thing to do to cool off. Um, we did see a little sand shark um, while we were out kayaking, which would be cool. A lot of birds, a lot of wildlife, things like that. Um, when you're kayaking, if there is any wind, always paddle against the wind so you're, you're going into the wind. You never want to be tired at the end of the day and having to fight the wind back home. That's always a drag. So whichever way the wind's going, go towards it at the beginning. So at the end of the day, you can just kind of coast back. It's a nice, easy ride. Um, after a couple hours on these kayaks, I mean, I'm thinking three to four hours, your back's definitely going to hurt. Mine did. So just be aware of that. Uh, I, I think four hours out in the sun is, is plenty. You know, if, if maybe there's some clouds out and kind of shade, you, you know, you could go four to six hours. But an eight-hour day of kayaking is definitely pretty long. Um, so those are my quick tips. If you guys have any suggestions yourself, please leave it in the comments. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks. Thanks.